What up, y'all? Hope you're having or had a great weekend. We're going to be doing a Supreme Chaos draft. And, uh, hop on in. Oh, Crucible of Worlds. It's not not very exciting. Pentad Prism is cute. Guardian Idols, pretty neat. Thank uh, you. Trinket Mage. Eric, what's going on? Thank you so much, buddy. 28 months. Really appreciate it, my dude. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, Pernicious Dude? Oh my goodness. Classics. Here's to ending the year with good vibes. Thank you. Simony Pop, man. Thank you so much, guys. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. I kind of like Guardian Idol. I mean, it's just a ramp card, which I think is all right. It's also colorless. Yeah, we'll take a guardian idol. Sure. What the heck? Oh, we get two things. I always forget you get two things, huh? Okay. Maybe Pentad Prism? Maybe we Skyreach Manta and we just try to take all the colors. It's weird if you take guardian idol to try to take all the colors, but, you know. What can you do? I'll take I'll take a pet. I'll take a Skyreach Manta, sure. Kaya's Wrath. I was actually kind of hoping that would be an, an Obzidaddy, but it is not. Hmm. Final payment. Sack a creature or enchantment. Hmm. I feel like Azorius Guildgate is probably pretty good for us if we plan on playing this Skyreach Manta. Trollbred Guardian is a 5-5 five, five for 5 that becomes a 7-7. Seven, seven. Hmm. Could play Kaya's Wrath. Alright, well, we're definitely taking the Guild Gate. I think I just like 5-5. Five, five. Oh, what up, Team J, bro? All right, what do we got here? We do want we want to take all the fixing that we we stumble across here. Oh, my dude, Matt. Here's hoping no battle for Zendikar pack. Fingers crossed, I guess. Fingers crossed. Um, yeah, shock is okay. Actually, Renegade map? Let's take this Renegade map. And I kind of like Maverick Thopterist. I feel like that dude's got to be better than... <clears throat> Plus, it's as a 5-drop, like... Yeah, let's take Thopterist. Makes 2-1-1 two, two, one, two, one, one flyers. Electrolyze. Oh, and is it Boilerworks? Oh, man, this pack just drafted itself. Yeah, we're definitely taking the Boilerworks. It works with Maverick Thopterist. And we're taking the Electrolyze. That's a pretty easy pack. What do we got here? Water Knot. Solid removal. Release to the Wind. Exile a non-land permanent. For as long as that card remains exile, its owner may cast it without paying its mana cost. Interesting. Unless there's a Gideon. No no battle for Zendikar pack. Unless there's a Gideon. Um, I, I mean, I'd rather I think I'd rather take Moment of Craving than Recovery right now. Baffling End is also pretty good. And we have Azorius Guildgate. It is three or less. But I think it's actually just Water, water, water Knot and Baffling End. This pack is not too exciting. Sarah Angel seems real good. So does Grow from the Ashes. I like Weight of Memory. I like drawing three cards. Um, <clears throat> we're going to take the Sarah Angel. And we're going to take Grow from the Ashes here. Okay, we got a Jory and Ruin Diver. It's 2-3 three for 3. When you cast your second spell, you turn draw a card. It's not the worst. 
Boulder Salvo is actually pretty decent. And Pulse of Moross is real good too. Zelly, actually, this is Oath of the Gatewatch, so. Not exactly. Um, Battle for Zendikar. Yeah, I think it's Pulse. And Boulder Salvo. Okay. Sacrifice a Braidwood Sexton Search Library for basic land, reveal it, put it in your hand. I mean, that's just like a renegade map, right? Except you're paying two more mana for it. it. Still does what you want. So we have no black. We're basically four color non black. I kind of like Reliquary Monk. Destroys an artifact or enchantment uh, when it dies. Eh, it's not as good. Two mana, this is one damage to any target. Flip a coin. If you lose, choose one of your opponents. That player gains. Oh, Christ. Jesus. <laughs> Well, I'll take Braidwood Sexton, I guess. Yeah, this pack's pretty doo-doo. Oh, what up, Chorwit? Uh, I think this is still probably the best card. It still gives us an out. I just don't want to spend three mana for this enchantment that does nothing, and it's also... Like, double blue, which, I mean, obviously we have a double blue card, but I don't really want to throw down on a million blue cards. Alright. Valakut Awakening. I don't hate it. When you begin life for the first time, make a 1-1. One, one. It also gives our creatures lifelink. So far we have pulse that gains us life, and that's pretty much it. Um, hmm. I can see taking Awakening and, and Kazandu Stomper is just a 6-5 that returns lands. Yeah, Molten Blast is fine. I don't hate it. Actually, Spring Mantle Cleric doesn't seem terrible for our deck, yeah. I mean, so here's, like, the problem is, like, we have so many 5 drops as, as it is right now. And I even kind of want to play Girl from the Ashes at 5, and even Boulder Salvo is also a 5. I think we're going to take the Valakut Awakening. And I think we just want something cheaper like Molten Blast here. Solar Blaze. That's interesting. Do any of my creatures survive that? Not yet, really. Gateway Plaza is a banger here. Yeah, let's take a Gateway Plaza. I think that's a pretty much a given. Um, I like Band Together. Band Together is real good. We only have four creatures right now. Yeah, I could see taking Narset. I'm okay with Narset here. Oh, Saltwater Cliff? Yeah, let's take a Saltwater Cliff. I think I'm going to prioritize lands because you get so many playables in this format. So I'm just going to take it before I even have the chance to not take it. Even Surveyor is pretty sweet. Hmm. Teamer Sabretooth might be the pick here. Like, being able to return Maverick Thopter seems pretty good. Yeah, Map the Waste is fine. It's not one of the more exciting uh, three mana find a land cards. Yeah, I think it's just Sabretooth. Sabretooth also combos with certain things. Oh, Affectionate Indrik. That's a dude. I think it's Boros Guildgate and Affectionate Indrik here. Deadly Visit's good. I love Inescapable Blaze. Yeah, let's take Indrik and Guildgate. Our land's looking pretty good, actually. 
Oh, okay. We just found the um, the domain set. Esper Cormorants is great. Let's take an Esper Cormorants. I do not think we were a Sigil of the Empty Throne deck. We have two enchantments so far. I kind of just like Nacatl Outlander here. It's just a solid 2-2. Seven colors, no fixing. I don't even know when that was. <clears throat> I think Outlander's just fine here. I mean, we have seven creatures. I don't think it's Ziggurat. Yeah, I'll take Outlander. Astral Cornucopia. Interesting. Yeah, Archetype of Imagination can just win games. They don't have flying. Our guys do have flying. Whenever this guy becomes untapped, draw a card. Yeah, that's pretty strong. Yeah, we're definitely taking Archetype. I think I'm just taking this guy. Actually, Snake of the Golden Grove is also good. 4-4-4-5, four, 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 you, you usually gain 4 life. It's, it's very uncommon to make the 7-7. Seven, seven. You guys like Snake over Disciple? Disciple not good? I thought that guy was good back in the day. I do kind of like Astral Cornucopia, especially for the fixing. Yeah, I'm going to take the Cornucopia. Oh, I like a Cold Steel Heart here. Ooh, protection from snow seems really good. Uh, just kidding. Um, Ronum Unicorn seems great. I'm definitely gonna worry. I think it's cold. I think it's cold steel heart. Ronum Unicorn here. <sighs> yeah, let's take Ronum and Coldy. Oh, Simic Growth Chamber? Banging. Wow, that's a banger. Not even going to second guess that one for a second. We got Azorius First Wing. Plaxmant is decent. Minister is pretty good. Seal of Doom would be a, a great pick. If we were black. Yeah, I think it's Minister. I think Minister's real good. Okay. Deathbringer Liege, which we have to look at as a triple white card because we're not playing the the black. Hmm, this pack's not great. Um, snake form is fine. I mean, Canker Abomination's fine as a double green creature. I think it's actually just Snake Form and Canker Abomination. Yeah, this card's fine. It's like I think this might be better than Canker as a 2-4 for double white. I mean, we already have Sarah Angel as double white as well, so I don't think that's a huge issue. I don't know. Snake Form says draw cards. I'm definitely taking that. We have one more pack. What's our last pack after this? Future Sight. Yeah, I think Harvest has a higher upside than the other guy. Bonded Fetch. Edge of Autumn. 2-2 two, two Flying Flanking. 3-3 three, three for 5. Um, well, I think it's definitely Edge of Autumn here. Yeah, I mean, 4 mana, four mana 2 2 flyer is fine. You can bounce some guys. Yeah, I guess it's I guess it's Edge and Aven Augur if we have to pick something from that pack. Alright, we have 13 creatures. Not too bad. 
28 cards. You can probably board in the Ronin Unicorn. Um, I don't think Molten Blast is... Maybe it's fine. Are there any creatures we're super excited about bouncing? Not really. This is going to be a three drop most of the time. And we also have two, we have two of these, so we can probably go 16 lands. Which means we only need three cuts. Yeah, we can probably cut one sextant. We also have Edgebottom, Grove from the, from the Ashes, and Cold Steel Heart, and Cornucopia. I'm going to cut Avon Augur. I'm not super impressed with Avon Augur. I mean, I do like having a main deck way to deal with an artifact that's problematic. But, I don't know. That seems niche. I can probably board that in if we really need it. Alright. Wow, this is, a, this is a mess of colors here. Properties. Let's, uh... I like that there's no black sources here. Which makes you also wonder if this isn't black or white, because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, okay, so it's just not counting it for either. All right. So we have one, two, three, four, five, probably go to six. See if six works here. Don't need that. Blue, we have nine blue symbols, which I think is actually one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, it's not counting the two hybrids. So 11. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 seems fine. Uh, 8 green sources. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We actually have 9 because of the hybrid. Green, we have 2. That's 4 sources, huh? Okay. Let's go down to 7 blue. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Red, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Red, we only have four cards. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we can definitely cut that for another green. Four. This is six green, seven blue. Plus, we have cold steel. Yeah, that seems good. All right. Let's see what we have. There's always very few sideboard cards. In oh, boy. Wow. <laughs> I mean, we can cast anything. Jeez. Oh, God. Do I mulligan and risk, like... Oh, my God. Not wanting Valakut Awakening, but why? Well, I just forgot. I literally just forgot it was in the sideboard. Yeah, we're going to put that in place of a mountain in the next game. You know what? I'll risk it. We can cast anything, right? So, I think I think keeping this is just as risky as mulliganing. I agree, but it's the devil, you know. I officially finished my Kirby deck, and my Kirby altered Volrath should be in this week. Nice. All right, you ready? Okay. This guy. This guy. Yeah, they haven't done anything either. One, two, three, four. Actually, this is pretty sweet. That didn't get countered? Oh, sweet. Sweetie boys. I 
However, we should have played a forest in case we draw team or saber tooth. Okay. Each creature with a plus one plus one counter on it has flying. Oh, I guess we could have still. We have Gateway Plaza, so never mind. I'm st that's stupid. I don't think we have any real benefits of keeping Renegade Map on the board since our single improvised creature is not there. What does this do? 3 2, whenever he deals combat damage to a player. Sure. Yeah, I'm going to crack this now. We have white, white, green, green, green. I'm just going to get a planes here. <laughs> For the Sarah Angel, I was going to say, but... Oh, yeah. We're going to keep two blockers back. I don't want them to bounce one of them, get in, be able to net a card. Opponent had a green creature into the battlefield under their control. You may pay a tap if it's two. Okay, but they tapped the creature I was already attacking with? I guess that's better than tapping a Thopter. I mean, they, they just didn't do it in combat. But yeah, see, this was my concern. Or they get rid of one blocker, and then I'm just like, well, this guy's going to deal damage anyway, right? So I think we're just taking it. I think the Nakatl Outlander is probably better than just soaking up two damage. Eh, Gus Skimmer, I don't really care about that. I mean, I've I've definitely I think I think Chaos Draft is significantly better when so same with Supreme Drafts. I think they're significantly better when you curate the packs. My sure. My favorite What is this doing when it when it sure. My favorite experience drafting uh Supreme was with Ravnica, and I, I thought that was just just fantastic. Um this guy doesn't fly, right? One, two, three, four, five. I think we're just playing Sarah, and next turn we can play Trollbred Guardian. Yeah, sure. Oh, I can gain flying. Ooh, fancy. Yep, seems good. Wow. Okay, so Ronum Unicorn is going to come in. Oh, they didn't attack at all. 
Fascinating. A little baffling end. What's the card that they got back? What's it called? Uh, permafrost trap. <sighs> okay, so it's literally just if we play a green creature, tap the dudes. Just getting rid of this guy because it does fly, and I think without a flyer, we're uh, in a little better shape. I'm gonna hold this guy back. I don't want them to get free cards off of Stromkirk Occultist, and if we play Trollbraid Guardian, it's likely they permafrost trap, tapping like this guy and this guy, so that we. But I mean, I'm not gonna not play five five so. Yep, there we go. Tap Troll Bread and Maverick Thopters. Wow. It's like I predicted the entire world. Yeah, this is fine. I mean, it denies them one card. We trade a 1-1... One, one for whatever card they may have drawn. Oh, that guy's fascinating. Okay. Well. I mean, I'm definitely gonna double block if they attack with this guy. Yeah, there's no world where I let this guy survive or at least don't try to get this guy out of here. Sure. Okay, you got it. That's a combination move. You got it. Just go to three here. What is your favorite set in magic? Oh, if you don't mind me asking, no, I do mind. That's a very personal topic. Um, I think it would be the original Ravnica block would be my favorite group of sets. Ravnica, Guild Pact, and Ascension. I just have a lot of positive memories, and I think that set was so utterly groundbreaking that... Well, this guy has Trample, and you have 3, 6, 7, 8, so you have enough to... Well, that's pretty easy. Cycle, sack green. Ho! Ho, ho, ho! That's game. <laughs> Get in there with everybody. So this is, yeah, this should be enough right here, even without the Electrolyze. Okie dokie. Artichokey. We also have Reliquary Monk. When that guy dies, you get to kill an enchantment. That seems pretty decent. Bring in Ronum for snake form. Oh. 
And I do kind of want Reliquary Monk here. Oh, Valakut Awakening instead of Mountain. This does mean we don't have any searchable red sources, unfortunately, which I don't love. Especially with Edge of Autumn and Grow from the Ashes and Renegade Map. Yeah, I don't I don't I don't actually think that's better. I mean you might be able to find a place for Valakut Awakening, but I don't think it's I don't think it's worth cutting the mountain for. I mean, I'm sure we can play both. I just don't... Um, I'm not really sure what to cut off the top of my head. Awakening is a land we can find off Narset. You're not wrong. I think seems good here. Maybe it's Harvest Gwyn Lion. No, maybe not. I don't even know, dude. I'm just gonna submit. Mm, Renegade map actually makes this playable. Go get a forest. Edge of Autumn for a third land. We're gonna draw Simic Growth Chamber. There's Astral Cornucopia. So we can actually turn three Cornucopia as well, which is pretty sweet. Let's get a forest. Play the forest. Edge of bottom. Get a plains here. And it's pretty good. Like an old fashioned love story, but you know, with cards. Okay. Okie dokie. So next turn we can, if we draw land, we can Indrik, kill this guy. If we don't, we can Baffling End. And then Boulder Salvo. I just ate pizza. I'm jealous. Well, they have no creatures left. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Land? Oh, we don't need land because we actually have Indrik here. Yep, it seems good. Get to sit on a 4-4. We can Teamer Sabretooth to bounce it if we draw another green. Oh, Shackles. That seems good. Turn another creature you control. Dang it. Four, one, two, three. Narset. Oh, boy. One, two, three, four. Sure. Well, Shackles is very good. What up, Sammy? Uh, I think it's actually just worth doing this. Giving them a 2-2. And keeping Narset alive for one more swing. Okay. Like it. Like it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven mana, huh?
works. Not ideal. Grow from the ashes. Almost less ideal. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Kick it. Let's get forest. Let's get two forests. We want a bunch of forests. You got it. Oh, I like that they didn't untap their Vidalcan shackles. So what do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 5, 9, and then bounce. That seems good. So play this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. this is going to be. One, two, three, four, um, okay. Sure. I mean, if they want to steal this guy, that's fine. It's not super exciting for them, so. This old chestnut. Hmm. Well, <laughs> seems good. Okay. One, two, three, four. Play saber tooth. One, two, three. Play this. Bounce of white again. Um, <laughs> yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven mana. So we could play Guardian, which they're probably going to steal, or we can just bounce Maverick. One, two, three, four, five, They have one card in hand. I'm okay with that. Oh, they didn't untap, so they just kept the Thopter. I like that. That means we get another activation with the Sabertooth here. Um, I actually, the last time I played the Arena Cube, I didn't enjoy it a ton because mostly there aren't enough cards available on Arena. Like, I felt like it was very lopsided and very bomb laden. Yeah, like, I feel like if we can overload the board with a bunch of 1 1s, I think we're actually probably where we want to be there. Oh, they didn't attack and they didn't untap their shackles. That's pretty good. Pulse? That seems good. 
Uh, one, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Play a land, play the Indric. So I have to pay twice X, which is 10. No, you got it. Okay. You got it. Thank you. Oh, Jonathan Harris. Thank you for the gift for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it, my dude. Welcome back. Um, sure. I'll just bounce this guy one more time. Oh boy. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we have thirteen mana, so six plus five is eleven. I'm just going to attack with two here. If they have a, an answer for the archetype, like a bounce it, they can block one of these guys. And then I don't want them to kill Narsa because I think being able to keep Narsa on order is pretty strong here. Okay, they gave us back the Sabretooth, which means no matter what they try to take, we can just bounce it, which is totally fine. This is why I wanted to keep the two extra mana up instead of just playing Thopterist or something. I'm going to make this a green. Sure. You got it. Also, I can, I can just bounce that guy. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. 
I see. Yep, you got it. But you're not going to block. Okay. Got it, got it. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This guy costs five, leaves two up. They're going to try to steal something. Which I guess is fine. Red, blue, three, four, five. Six, Thopterist. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, you can only they, they can only steal one thing, so not like oh, they didn't even untap it. That's fantastic for us. Seems good. Yeah, this card is just bananas. Okay, we win that match. Yeah, that was inevitable, really. Like we could just make a million guys. We could bounce whatever they put their stupid things on. Whatever they try to steal, we could bounce. Like, our deck is sweet. Oh, Juposhi. Thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Yeah, had we seen the Shackles, I would have definitely brought in Molten Blast, but we did not see it in game one. Yeah, I don't. I think I'm fine with the Valakut Awakening being the side. We're not super high on it. Like, maybe over Snake Form, actually? I don't know. Snake Form seems pretty good. Combos with Electrolyze. Let's our guys kill anything. Triggers Boulder Salvo. Yeah, I could see Artifact being in the main deck, but I think our deck is so tight as it is that I'm not super concerned with it. Especially when a lot of the artifacts are just creatures. <laughs> I'm going to mulligan this hand. This one I will keep. I'm going to send a forest back. And this is actually nice because we're on the draw, but we have some growth chamber, so we can actually go turn one. Oh, well, we also have renegade map as well, so we can go planes into map, bounce growth chamber. Well, bounce with growth chamber. And then we can easily go get it red with the map, but we're going to keep it up for now in case we draw, like, Maverick Thopterus in the next two turns. Wow, that's a lot of Signets. Okay. It's not exactly what we want. Got our single... See, this is why we want to be able to search for a mountain here. Your counter mine a Cattle Outlander. Sure. You got it. Y you know what? No, you got it. It's, uh, it's a hell of a counter. Oh, uh, I do not have the camera set up for the dog cam, unfortunately, so. Okay, well, that's a dude. Man. Turn, turn late, unfortunately. Next time we can play uh, Skyreach Manta, though. Champion of Wits. I forgot what Finals Week feels like. It still sucks, even if it's all remote. Yeah, I can imagine. One, two, three, four. Cornucopia is actually probably the better play next turn. I 
Yeah, Manta's a 4 4 flyer, though. Yeah, not blocking this guy. Uh, the last thing I want is for them to be able to reanimate this guy and dr draw like a million cards. That's unfortunate. They have three cards in hand. We have like a thousand. Weight of memory, pretty good. They just milled Land, Grove from the Ashes, Sarah Angel. The only one I really care about is the Sarah Angel. We still have Pulse of Moros in our deck, so that's fine. We also have six power in there. I hear you. Oh, they're not coming in here. They're going to the bathroom. Um, okay. Well... I definitely just feel like we're electrolyzing mom. Four, five, six. We can actually attack for eight. We can kill both of these. One, two, three, four. And like, they, this is their... Yeah, I think we're just killing both of these here. This is just a better use of mana. Let's add a blue. Because now we get to attack for eight here, and they go to eight. And then we have six in the air. If they want to unearth Champion of Wits for seven, that's like one, two, three, four, five. So that's most of their mana. That's all of their mana. So if they play a land, we can actually baffling end the token and then just get in there for a million. I hear you. No. Did you win your commander game or did you? I lost. You lost? Yeah. Jeez. I was playing um, Torborn. And it turns out I do a lot of damage to myself in my lands. And then you price progress and I died. Did you try not dying instead? No, I didn't have any counter spells. In hand. One, two, three, four. What is this? any any card, right? You just play another card. You cast a spell if your team isn't. Yeah, okay, cool. Your deck looks looking wild. I mean, I'm gonna attack with both these guys. If they want to chump, if they want to block one with a with a helio knot, that's totally fine with me. Okay. Well, I will trade with the helio knot. Okay, there we go. He was like, oh, my Heliona has flying? Wow. I didn't even know. John, a.k.a. JTHD, was playing Gitrog, so we're both playing like graveyard decks, and Jim was just like, I'm just going to kill you with Price of Progress, you stupid nerds. <laughs> <laughs> the cool graveyard synergies, too bad you're dead. Did you try not being dead? <laughs> yeah, I gotta start playing Not of the Bone or something. That one's a banger. Oh yeah, this is their seven mana turn. Sure, you got it. I feel like this is basically just they this just the same. Out. This is the Chaos Draft story. Yeah. Now this is my standard deck, my constructed deck. Well, it looks like garbage. <laughs> it was fun though. Fun okay, game. we win the game. So what do we see? A bunch of floaty boys. And Molten Blast can definitely come in here because Mono Signets dot deck. Yeah, 
Um, get her a snake form, I guess. Fabloop. <laughs> also did that thing where I messed up. You did the thing where you messed up? Yeah, I thought I didn't have a mana, but I forgot about land drop, and I could have murdered mm -hmm. the person that obnixless me. God, was it like being amateur hour? <laughs> Ditch this Frank for more commander. Oh, wow. I was like, who said that? I'm like, oh, I know who said that. <laughs> wow. John himself. Unbelievable. I've played enough commander this week, I think. If it isn't the Westhoff himself. I think I've played six commander games this week. Five or six. That's that's, that's, that's a, a good amount, man. I think you've played more commander games in the past two weeks than you have... In the past year? Yeah, that's pretty yeah. obvious because there was no... <laughs> All proceeds go toward treatment for Mike's addiction to eating human hair. Thank God wow. someone's getting them the help he needs. All we need is a one drop or a two drop. Oh, there it is. We did it. I mean, in order to not have to discard. And their deck isn't necessarily fast, so... Now we can just bounce the... Probably island. We want to be able to keep... Uh, the potential for double green. That's the name of the next, my next novel. What is it? You're going to eat human hair for a living? No. God damn it, I should have actually attacked here. That would have been better. Yeah, that's pretty bad. If they lose it too, I'm going to be real upset. Yeah, you also could have cast um, Gitrog that turn as well. You definitely could have won. But I also could have won on the one turn where I could have played Triumph of Horns, but I forgot about my land. So I could have murdered you with that. And then easily finished off Jimmy. I could have finished off little Jimmy. <laughs> oh, little Jimmy. I got greedy and wanted to play an Avengers in the car. One, two, three, four. Maybe if you... Because I thought it was cool. But winning's probably... You know what cool. else is cool? Winning. Fucking robots, Michael. <laughs> You're right. Robots are cool. I like when they cycle how the art goes away. That's really cool. <laughs> Man, you only need art sometimes, Michael. You don't need it all the time. I thought you had your arm resting on your cup, and I was like, wow, that's really precarious, bro. What is this thing? Search your library for a multicolored card reveal. Okay, sure. You know what? You got it. I've never seen that card before. I ain't never seen... Did they play the island? Yeah, they did. You ain't never seen a friend like me. No, that's a card, Michael. Oh, dang it. You gotta remember that one. Oh, he's getting Tatiova? Oof, the value is fucking thick. The value is thick? Yeah. Fascinating. Fascinating. Raw as rain. I kind of just want to electrolyze this small dude. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, next turn I kind of want to kill both of the... No, I can't kill this guy. I guess I'll keep... But then I got this. So many things to do, man. Once he equipped, though. You know. I hear you. I just want to electrolyze. Oh, that's not as good. Damn it. Damn it. I need a white source here. Like yesterday. You ain't never had a friend like me. You know that song, Mo? You ever heard that? I heard that one time yeah tattoo oh wait did they not have a follow-up land oh boy well shit wait if you control four or fewer lands oh sweet yeah oh baby that's the ticket out there oh yeah that's what we wanted okay well 
That card's like a mythic rare in my commander deck. This? Yeah. Really? With Titania, like you either get a land early or you get or a Or 5 3. Land. Yeah. And draw a card. It's super sick, yeah. That seems good. I'm actually tempted to block with Guardian Idol and then Molten Blast the Tatiova. What is this they're doing? What are they convoking something? Wait. What? Why are they tap Oh, because of this thing. Oh. Okay. Wait, but what? Oh, because they need a second blue. Got it. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Why? Oh, wow. They just hit Cold Steel Heart, Land, Astral Cornucopia. I didn't want to draw any of those, really. So that's okay, I guess. Hello. Who are you talking to? I don't know. You just said I'm hello, so I'm saying it back. Huh? Mm. Ain't no hell back, girl. I'm just going to kill this. This is going to keep them in the game. Yeah, them hammer boys are at it again, you know. Boy, you ain't kidding, man. That one, Shadow one, Sphere. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Damn it. Oh. Man, I found out the other day that Shadow Sphere has a second ability. The card's wild. I never heard of that before. Actually, let's go one, two, three, four, five. Sera. One, two. my drink over here so that our drinks aren't touching the last mm. thing you want is for the drinks to touch oh john katie just she gets stressed out by children she's she like stresses her out for some reason she what she gets stressed out well she was hearing the kids in the background and she was like stressing her out really yeah huh. i was like yeah there's they have kids and she's like oh this sounds so stressful flying on the bottom of its owner's library you son of a biscuit get wrecked that's, that's almost worse than a dying one two three four five six seven eight nine You ain't never had for like big. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Play this for five. And that's it. Probably just play this guy. No, let's play this guy. No, this guy. Children are stressful. Have you ever seen the fingernails on those things? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Gross. That Tatio is going to win the game. No, we're going to draw our own at Indrik Stomp Haller. Or Affectionate Indrik. That's not it, but it's here somewhere. Okay. One, two, three, four... Nope, don't want to use that. Yeah. Wow. This is a... Are you okay? No. Yeah, you're acting real weird, man. I need Jesus. Buddy. I know. Oh, this gentleman. No, I should probably pay Katie for I will double dollars. block and assume you don't have an answer. Oh, well, you didn't. Yeah, let me rate McDonald's. What are you going to rate it? P good. Does it rate you back? Yeah, man. That's pretty cool, dude. No, that's not. Oh, actually, I guess I do have an account. All right. Eh, sure, I don't care about that, but it's pretty good with your other thing. Oh! 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 One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope, don't want to use all the white here. Or green, rather. Uh, 
else? Uh, white. Mina and Dina. Oh boy. It's a big fat worm. It's a big old worm. Look at my worm. Oh wow, this is amazing. That is something. Oh wow, they just get to turn our land. Oh boy, this is. They are doing well here for themselves. Holy Jesus. That guy's got first strike? Budge. So five, they can go two and two, they can die to this. two things or one thing okay sure wow that seems fine um, okay all right the yeah, cards pretty obnoxious why haven't they activated this and just killed my blocker I don't really understand like they just win if they do that right they deal three to this guy and then kill me. I don't. I'm not really sure, but. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, is Nier only deals a tap creature? That's a good idea. That's a good reason. Sam. He was real excited. Um, you know what? I'll give it a I'll give it the old college try. What's going on out there? Who knows, man? Well, it's kind of worth knowing because sometimes the dogs get into things they shouldn't. Oh, maybe I should go check that. Yeah, that's why I mean like if they're eating plastic or like food or they probably are. Chicken bones, it's worth knowing. Michael's leaving. Never come back. Where are you hungry? It's Plastic. Yep, that's what I was afraid of. Land? Not a land. How is that even possible? <laughs> I don't know what happened, but fuck if that doesn't sound funny. What was he doing? <laughs> God. That dog. Hey, you suck being a bad boy. <sighs> oh, did they just mill? Yeah, alright. It seems fine. Let's see, I have a pulse target. If we hit a land here, that's great, because we can go pulse. We didn't hit a land. We hit a five drop. How did he even smell that? What did he smell? Okay. <sighs> he 
He was digging in one of my Christmas bags. That was presents for Katie. There's chocolate in it. Did he eat it? No, he didn't get far enough. What did he do? He was digging into one of the bags that had Christmas stuff in it. The one that I had near the tree. That was kind of already open. The Amazon one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't. Why would you leave that on the floor, though? Was it edible? Yeah. He didn't get into it, luckily. Okay. There was chocolate in there, so I'm glad I caught him in time, but... He did. Yeah, I don't want to look at his little Jedi. He did get. A, he did get a bunch of the plastic off though. So, oh my God, dude. Wrapped with love by Watson. <laughs> okay, well, can... what do you want a reward? I'm glad I stopped him so he didn't kill himself with chocolate, <laughs> and also ruin a present. <laughs> All in one glorious moment. Oh, I played the wrong lane, but that's okay. We'll just play 5-5 five, five instead. I got Katie a big bag of Twix. I know you told me. Oh, I did? I forgot. Okay. You also got Watson a big bag, apparently. Almost. Yeah, this is why when I hear something in the background, I'm like, I wonder what that noise is. And you're, and you're just like, ah, who knows? I'm like, well, we should go check because dogs. It's like having children. Oh, good. They're going to go get their, their tattoo of an, oh, behemoth sledge. That seems good. Man, don't be ruining secrets. Who? God. Yeah, you're a little bitch, nature's little treasure. More like nature's little bitch. More like it. Hmm. Man, he threw that big ass rock at him. Oh, well, apparently they're gonna do some shit, so. She's getting a lot of random phone calls from different sounds. She has a lot of pre saved. <laughs> yeah, there, she just gets. Sometimes she just gets 30 calls at once, and then she has them each uh, with different ringtones. Yep. I'm about to be nature's little boot up your... No, you're not. What, are you going to fight in a parking lot? Yeah, I don't think so, man. Oh, God. Electrolyze. Land. Seems Almost good. as good. Well, I guess we get to eat it with a mom. Do what now? We get to kill this. Oh. Because of your mother. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm tapping with that. I would literally just lose the game, so. We're just tapping with this. Oh, they're doing more stuff. I got two cards in hand. Oh, fucking Advent of the Worm. Who doesn't love an Advent of the Worm? What's Hammer do? It's literally just Armadillo Cloak that you can re-equip. Use plus plus two plus two plus two lifeline and trample. Also, that's not a good answer if they don't know what armadillo cloak does. But it's a great answer if they do. True. I'll take my chances, Michael. What? Are you okay? Oh, never mind. I got really. We're good. What, what? I saw Watson outside and I was like, for some reason, part of my room was like, that's not in the backyard. So I got real. It's in the backyard. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> what a fucking weirdo. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I thought he escaped. I was like, oh no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I don't want you to get this guy back. Watson's going to give me a heart attack. Hanging out over there. 
this hunter? What's he doing, you think? I don't know. They're probably all just smelling butts and stuff, you know? No, he's sniffing the grass or the concrete. Same thing. I mean, I think he's got Defender. You know, but, oh, they have no cards in hand? Okay, that's pretty good for us, actually. Yeah, I don't care about that. It's like a total waste of mana. Like, you're 26. You don't need the extra life. Just... Come on, float. Well, they didn't have anything to do with the mana, though. So, like, what's the... what's the? It doesn't really change anything. You're just going to spend it on the turn again. You're just going to spend it on drugs. Yeah. Okay. I mean... Sure. Champion is a bitch. God damn. It really is. Sure. Can I just get one good water knot? Give me a water knot. Thank you. We got seven. We got 14 air damage here. Baron Von Vaderham, welcome back. Thank you for the reset, buddy. Yeah, what a name. Remember that time Michael left chocolate on the floor and expected Watson to not find it? It was in plastic. Like, wrapped. What is that? How's that? What? How do they he, smell it? He's a dog. Dogs are wild. They can smell fucking cancer, Michael. Have you ever smelled cancer before? No. Yeah. Bet it stinks. Bet you stink. Dang it. You little shit devil. There you are. <laughs> oh, nice pilgrim's eye. More like shit eye. <laughs> Got him. You're going to get shit in your eye. If we draw like electrolyze, we just win, right? Um. Yeah. I don't think that does anything particularly. I mean, it gets gets get rid gets rid of the uh, the stupid champion, which is fine. And since we're at eight, I think that's probably fine. Um, you can make this a 3-3, three, three, so I'm just going to attack with these guys. Block here, block here. If you do switch it over, I want to still be able to have a 4-4 four, four blocker and a 3-3 three, three blocker, so. But, next turn we should have lethal in the air if they can't deal with archetype. Where I bet they can. Don't care about that. Yep, got it. There's only 10 cards in their deck, so. <laughs> yep, seems really good. Must be nice. One, two, three. Oof. This gets two cards out of our deck. It's got to be better, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. You doing okay? You just hitting things? Slapping it up. Mm -hmm. Slapping it down. I 
card's fucking immutable. Fucking eye roll. Yep. Cool. Doesn't have first strike, I guess. So, I guess that's really where we're at right now. doing oh god sure you got it you added up I don't even know why you tap this instead of just sure you just move the hammer over yeah there you go Cool. Must be nice losing to the same fucking mythic every game. Yeah. Thought that would be the one time we trophied, but heaven forbid we didn't face mythic bombs. Sure. Oh, what up, Badger? <sighs> Guys, children. Dear God. Wow. Look at this layer I just played. God, he really doesn't let you live it down, does he? He really doesn't. Oh, that's a thing. Let's play that. Don't counter my cornucopia, bro. Don't copia me, bro. Don't counter copia me, bro. Boo -doo 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 -doo. Hmm. What do you think the odds are that this guy does a thing that we that we want to happen? Like resolve. He's like, oh no, now I have my counter. Oh, all right. I don't know what's going on right now. He's just got his heroes, whatever, their doom or murder, or you know, all the black heroes spells. doom or murder. They okay. They hit Viridian Claw. What so okay, it? remember this card we made fun of? We're like, that's never gonna do anything. Well, basically did nothing. Yeah, no, they just revealed this, and that was it. So they just literally threw this. They're like, discard this card, and you're like, all right, cool. Turns out random cards aren't good. Oh, Except for, like, maybe it. Gamble. Oh, I do have four lands. Oh, man. But do I even want to play it? I don't think so. Nah, bro, get that extra card. Fuck a land. Fuck a land, bro. You got all your colors, right? Buddy, I got more than all my colors. Yeah, you got an extra color. You could even be black if you want I could get, I could be I got two blacks right now. Wild. It's crazy. Wild and crazy kids. Katie said the dogs make me lack confidence about having human children. <laughs> I mean the truth is I think dogs are actually harder to manage. Not mm. take care of, but just manage than human children. Oh, what'd they do? Oh, they just exiled all my guys. 
cool. Hmm. What, what land are we getting rid of here? Plains. Oh, it's your boy. Thoppy Jones. Thoppy Jones. Thoppy Jones, yeah. Hmm. Whenever another creature enters battlefield under control, a creature gets neg one. That's pretty good considering we have two one ones. Two thoppy boys. Neg one. What? What does that even mean? What are you saying right now? You sound like a crazy person. Oh, look. Grixis Illusionist, you're playing this trash? That's wild, man. The card's real bad. It's actually terrible. It's a 1-1 one, one for 1. Uh, sure. Fixing for their 2-color deck? Yeah, alright, well. To each their own. To peach their beach. What? Don't worry about it. I'm not. I'm not really concerned necessarily. I just don't know why you are the way you are. Maybe they have a progenitus. Yeah, <laughs> that one Grixis guy is definitely gonna get there. Blue. <coughs> oh Jesus! Come on! Don't die, Michael. Don't die. That's how you wanted it. Get, make your mind. Oh, die, Michael. <laughs> sure. You got it. Squally boy. I'm just going to play this guy. They have one card. I, somehow I don't think it's a creature, but maybe they'll draw a creature and be really lucky. Oh, your guy's dead. You think so? Oh, he's murdered. I don't know, man. They have one card in hand. This deck does not strike me as a particularly aggressive lots of creature deck. Yeah, I'll take five. Oh, bam, but they got a creature. Their last card's a creature. Oh, come on. Not only is it a creature. Oh, my God. It's a very good... They're literally just going to murder your whole team. Yeah, that's cool. It's super cool that they did their one rogue to get in with, huh? They don't, they don't have a rogue. I thought proud to be rogues. They just cast the spell. Oh. Gotcha. Yep. Cool. That was super sweet. Odds of that whiffing? <sighs> That's incredible. Yeah, he didn't whiff. What does Pulse even do here? Like, there's nothing we can draw here that actually saves us, unfortunately. Could have used that last turn. <sighs> cool. Literally lost to a rare again. Sweet. Yeah, I really, I, I don't know. Every time I think I'm liking this format, it just comes around and fucks me in the ass, and it's just kind of like, well, okay, that's cool, I guess. Guess I should have played around your noxious throng, notorious throng. That makes five one one flyers and kills my whole board. Yeah. Cool. What do you even copy here? Maverick Thopters, probably. Yep. It's 
seems good. Oh. Yep, cool. From a deck that seems actually terrible. That's fucking hilarious. Like, <laughs> oh man. We play a 5-5, five, five, they play Erratic Mutation on it, just gets a free card, doesn't do anything. Oh my god. None of these cards are any better against their deck. Maybe Molten Blast is fine instead of like Snake Form. Kills their 4-2, I guess. Yep. Sure. What can you do? Let's draw a Simic Growth Chamber or a Gate. Okay, well that's neither. Let's draw a Cornucopia or a Cold Stone Heart. Just gonna keep naming things that are Nice Viridian Claw. Oh, that's actually really good on this board. It's going to be four lands. You ready? Mm. Guardian Idol? I don't think so. It's not exciting. Actually, eh, good water knot. It's still removal. Slap, slap, and Joe. Oh, I like a renegade map here, actually. That's pretty decent. That'll fix us. Will it show me the card? Oh, it was a notorious throng. Interesting. I guess I don't have to worry about that. So we can crack this to get a green and make a 4-4. Four, four. Seems good. Seems good. Oh, seems good. Mm -hmm. Remember that time the dog was in the on the side of the house? Mm -hmm. Just out running around like like no what does this thing do? Okay, sure. Well, let's go get a green. How about that? Let's get a Gren. Gren and six. Gren and Barrett. I can keep going, Michael. God, I wish you wouldn't. I could do this all day. Oh, look at that. Did you look at that? Would you look at that, Michael? Would you look at that? Hmm. Oh, you're 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 a, you're a pig. A pig, a piggy pig. Yeah, you are a piggy pig. Pig, pig, pig. Keep going. Pig, pig, pig. We could attack there, but there's a lot of flash creatures, and it's a one-one and. If they play a 4-5... Oh, okay. <sighs> yep. Boy, might just have to attack with this guy. I don't know if we're gonna get through otherwise. I'd probably save the Sabertooth to when you can... Oh, you can't bounce himself, right? No, and I also can't even play it, so... Oh, yeah. True that. What about Badger? Thoppy Jones would be nice. Badger, I missed these facts of the day. 
He talked about how dinosaurs can quack. I did see that. And it made me uncomfortable. <laughs> I was like, that shouldn't be right. One, two, three. But I tell you, that ain't right. Gotta be four, I guess. What if you use the man in the pool? Do you ever think about that, stupid? Yep. I'm gonna murder that dude. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, big murder. Fuck out of here. <coughs> you got it, man. I like you, bro. I like him even better when he can't move. <laughs> Goodbye, you little shit otter. How rude, man. No. Slap, slap edges. What did you just do? You just exiled my tapper? Sure. You have zero cards in hand. You overpaid for that? I don't even know what's going on here. I think our bonus is wild. Okay. That's what father likes. Where my green mana at? What do you got here? <laughs> okay. Why are they playing that? I don't know, man. It's so bad. This just gets plus one, plus zero. Sure, I don't. They want to fix their two color deck, I guess. Ooh, that's a good one. That gets father all he needs. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. That gets father all he needs. Green and a green. A double green. Look at all our beautiful manuses. Look at my layers. I'm going to make a layer joke here. <laughs> I didn't make that. I didn't make a layer joke. Okay. You're, you wanted to, though. Come on, buddy. No, no, you wanted to. You don't know anything about me, Michael. You definitely don't know about my layers. I'm like an onion, Michael. What are you in, Trek? Actually, I should have played the stupid saber tooth first. Damn it, I'm going to be penalized for it. <sighs> Whatever. I'll manage. Yeah, that was bad. This is how you lose games that you're supposed to win. I still think you're going to win. I think we're fine, yes, but it still doesn't justify my choice. Would you say it wasn't justified? No, only Raylan Givens can say that, Michael. Can his character from The Office also say it? No. Doesn't work that way? No, Michael. It's not called The Office. It's not called The Justif Office. Ju the Justif the Office. Fied. Knees. Knees. Just gonna submit. Okay. I like this hand. Okay. Shut up, Michael. <laughs> okay. Alright, we're going to go this into Renegade map. Are you talking about Danny Cordray? Yeah. Everybody knows about Danny Indeed. Cordray. Uh, yeah, let's go map it up. Have you guys ever heard the one about the penis museum? <laughs> <laughs> And that's why, and then I said, that's why I took you to the Penis Museum, where tickets are a thousand dollars. Anyway. Oh, hey, Danny. <laughs> Who 
Look at that cormorant, Michael. You ever what about ants? Excuse me? They're so small, you know. <laughs> They're so tiny, man. Can you even imagine? Can you even imagine being an ant, Michael? No. Look at this guy. It's going to fix their mana. Oh, that otter is just dead. And it's going to be kind of sad, but not not really that sad because... What does the otter do? Uh, it's just a Nephidian. Okay. Like whenever it deals combat. Yeah, I know what Nephidian is. Okay, I'm so sorry. I'm so tremendously sorry. I your manager for you talking to me like that. I am the manager. Look at me. I am the manager now. Are you really? Remember they made Nephidian into a flash enchantment? None of those things were words. I'm so sorry. They weren't? No, they were like... It was... No, I don't know what it was, man. I'm sorry. It was like hamburger cheeseburger, you know? Who knows? <laughs> Who does know, bro? I'm an idiot. I should be playing champion with some of my decks. I didn't, I didn't want to say anything, but... See, this is the benefit of playing Chaos Draft. You're like, oh, what, what kind of cards do I get to play? Also, oh, both this guy and the last guy had counter school, or it runs it together. <sighs> it really does. So I think I just might play Esper Cormorant here. Before or after your mad solo? Always <clears throat> after, Michael. Always after. Yeah, you can play a bird. You can put a bird on it. I mean, this is a lot of mana sources, unfortunately, but this guy will, this guy will get us there. You ever going to go search for a basic man? No, nah, I'm good. Weird. Well, that was really immature, but your creature sucks. So I'm not super worried about it, I guess. One, two, three, four. You know what? You should just die on a turn. What's the difference? Uh, there's none. Okay. You got a planes? Is there a problem? Don't you need a green so you can grow? I do, but I'm a <laughs> grower, not a shower, Michael, so. Huh. Yeah, that was actually a mistake on my part. It's okay, next turn we'll play Indrick. You just want to give him more time. It's fair. Well, they're not doing anything exciting, so. Okay, sure. Another 2-2. Two, two. You got it. I'm just going to play my big daddy. This guy really likes playing 2-2s. Two Sure does. Sure does. Kill it. You know, you're not very good, good control deck if you don't have any finishers. So one, two, three, four, five. We get two extra mana from this, so I can actually go growth and two troll bread next turn. Okay, it's a 2 4 flyer. Got it. Oh boy. Blue, 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 blue. Red, red. Let's get a green. And a, this one, maybe? Sure. Play another green. Now we have four lands in our hand, which is not ideal. That's it, huh? Interesting. Seems like an easy double block there to me, but what do I Yeah, I, I agree. I was like, well, I would have blocked the avian in this guy. Because they're not close to seven. They only have five lands, so it's not like they're just, like, setting this guy up. Here we go. Something something broken. I guess he wants to die. Oh. 
fucking cool. Wait, I thought there had to be two creatures. There, oh, there were. There were. They got nine power worth of creatures killed there. <clears throat> oh, boy. What, they're just going to only block with this guy? I'm not sure I understand, but all right. All right, that was fascinating. What, Kokusho? Expel? I don't know what's going on right now. Buddy? Neither do I. Pulse of Marasa would be amazing right now. Okay, Bloody Ghost. You got it. What? That was your... <coughs> that was very weird. All right, let's sack an island, actually. Pulse of Marasa. Borrow Skilled Gate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's all I rang. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What are you, the so you're getting killed by little tiny nerds? I'm pretty sure when they tapped all their mana, they were trying to get back Champion of Wits, but they didn't realize it cost, cost seven, seven instead yeah. of six. And so, like, after throwing this guy away because they forgot about my onboard 2-2, two -two, sure. Like, I don't know. Like, this is this... Like, we're just losing to, like, the worst possible plays, unfortunately. Yeah, that's that's a good ground, dude. Yeah, man. Yeah, I can't even attack here, because if we attack and they have an answer, like, we're just dead. So I guess we're going to go to two here. Hopefully we'll get back Pulse. Is that unblockable? We... What? Is that unblockable? No. Just the two one. So why don't you just block with the... Idle. Because if they have an ant, if they have a removal spell, oh. we're dead. Like that, then we'd be dead. Hmm. Alrighty, last turn, but then we get to lose to Noxious Throng and drawing fourteen lands. Yep, there you go. Yeah, this is just a terrible match to lose, especially when they're misplaying left and right. Yep. Pulse of Marasa. <laughs> All right. Sounds good. Fun games. Would love to go back and see what I would have drawn. Yeah, cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time.